Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to enable the 2FA on crypto.com in 2024. So today, we're taking your account security to the next level by exploring how to enable the two-factor authentication 2FA for your crypto.com account. With 2FA, you will add an additional layer of protection to your digital assets and personal information. So join me as I walk you through the steps of enabling 2FA on crypto.com in 2024. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you will need to go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case, it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, basically go to the CRL section and simply type crypto. So, sorry. Crypto.com and hit the enter button. This should take you into the home screen or main screen of crypto.com right away. So here, of course, you'll be able to download the app, of course, if you don't have it already to log in into your accounts if you have an account and if you don't have an account of course you'll be able to go and create your account as you can see they offer a lot of things that you can scroll down to read the more information about it so if you click here on download the app you'll be able to scan this qr code to download it on your phone so for me i'll just go to the url section I'll just leave it as it is and i'll add login in here and click on this first link of course to log in into my account so here i'll have just to enter my credentials to log in into my account. Of course, if you don't have an account, as an example, you'll be able to click on sign up now as an example, and you'll be able to sign up into a new account if you don't have an account. So let's say as an example, you wanna create an account, just go and enter your formations in here, make sure it contains everything that they say in here, then click on sign up, and you'll be able to log in into or to create an account. So as an example, I'll have to verify my email, so I'll go to my email provider in here. I'll go to this. So 72, 67, and 60. So 72, 67, and 60. Click on verify. And as you can see, I'll have to fill up some other information. For me, I'll just enter some random information for you. Make sure to enter like uh, accurate information, for example. So month, 02, day, 02, and year 2002. Nationality, I'll just type like here and click on continue. Please do the captcha so that's a robot click on continue and as you can see here you'll have to enter your phone number you will need that for sure of course if you uh, want to create a crypto.com uh, account so I'll just go here and enter my phone number as an example of course this is a random phone number so if they ask me for a code i'll not be able to provide that so let me just go and try again to do so click on that's a robot submit and so they cannot offer exchange services for me at the time being but it's fine so for you will have to enter your phone number of course that's because of just the country that i entered or i guess the phone number that is fake so for you just go and log in into your account if you have an account and if you don't you'll have to go and create an account and then you'll be able of course to have access to account settings where you will be able to enable the 2fa for me as an example, since I cannot, uh, like, I should have an account, but I don't know why they sh they are not logging me, uh, logging me into my account. Like, I don't know if I forgot the password or something like that. Let me just go and try to log in again. So maybe there's an error at the moment. So it's fine. I'll just go and look for an article, for example, on how to enable it. Of course, for the steps, it's simple. You'll basically have to go to your account settings and look at the security settings and there you'll find an option where to enable the two-factor authentication right away. You can even choose, choose your 2FA method uh, such as the SMS text message, authentication app or email verification. Choose the authentication app which is recommended and then you'll have to install uh, an authentication app like Google Authenticator, Microsoft Authenticator or even some extensions example that you may use on your browser and then you can go there uh, click on plus scan the QR code that they give you or enter the setup key code and then you'll find the code then in there you'll have to type it in the crypto.com and you'll be good to go for more visualization like uh, for you of course to understand more i'll just go and look for an article example so uh, enable the 2fa and like crypto.com so Okay, let's see here as an example an article so yeah it seems like it shows some visualization uh, so as you can see what is that how does 
this work? Which actions on crypto.com app can in, uh, can enable the 2FA? How to set up the uh, 2FA? So first of all, which authenticator should I use? Of course, as you can see, uh, there's a lot of uh, things that you can use. They provide for your like, authency for Android and Twilio Authy for iOS. And Authy, of course, is not only supporting generating a time-dependent six-digital code like other authenticators in the market, but also offering the following features like multiple device functionality, encrypted recovery backups, and etc. So how to enable it to FA? You'll have to go to your dot, uh, crypto.com app if you're using it on your phone. If you're using it on your PC, just go and uh, log in into your account. Go to settings, mm -hmm. then security. As we said, security settings. So once you go to your profile and settings, just click on security. You'll find yourself with that and go to this two-factor authentication right here as an example. So once you do so as an example, so uh, enter the passcode that they give you. So as you can see, you'll be here. You'll have to enable it. Once you click on enable, you'll have to enter the passcode that you have on your phone, uh, on your app. And then of course, they'll give you this uh, QR code. So make sure to scan it. If you cannot scan it for some reason, as you can see, they'll give you a setup code in here. Make sure to copy it into your authenticator app. And then you'll have, once you click on proceed to verify, you'll have to enter the uh, code that is provided by the app that you choose. So as you can see, mi uh, minimize that, go to auth authenticator app, select the option to add another account then choose to enter manually the security key or scan the qr code as an example if you can then paste the code in the text field by pressing and holding it over you should see the option paste change uh, save uh, saves or save the changes and the authenticator app will start to generate to fa codes with an expiration time of 30 seconds so please bear in mind that the code should consist of the numbers only yeah so then just copy that code and open crypto.com after uh, seeing that just enter that code in here and click on continue and you will find yourself good to go with 2fa enabled on your crypto.com so that's going to be it for me today you successfully uh, understand or know how to enable the 2fa on crypto.com on your account so with 2FA or two-factor authentication uh, activated, your digital asset and personal information are now better protected. So keep your authentication method safe and consider enabling the 2FA for any other accounts for enhanced security. So if you have a question or there's a specific topic that you'd like me to cover in the next tutorial, just drop it down below in the comment section. I'll try to do it as soon as possible. And if you have, or if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to our channel for more helpful toys like this one. If you have any other issues, feel free to contact their support. They will help you as soon as possible. So that's going to be it for me today. Happy trading, holding, and securing your accounts. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.